Takaji Zaiten. He is Dairoku Tenmao in a higher name. He comes out of the highest realms where the demon lord resides. He enjoys watching change and reincarnates every 1600 years to watch it all. So, as he's basically like the mightiest of the devils. And I like how his mustache just points upward. It makes him look like he has horns. Very threatening. Uh, hey, hey guys, the K78 back here with more Persona 4 Golden. In the last one, we just made it here and we did, agreed to rescue Marie. So let's dive right in. Uh, those are ominous statues. Be careful, Senpai. I'm getting some bad vibes from here. We'll just jump right in and I'll show you a lot of things that have to deal with this dungeon. You can hear a voice from somewhere. Where am I going, you ask? Don't ask stupid questions. I don't need a map. I throw away my compass. My heart will show me the way. I walk by myself. Am I not lonely, you ask? Yeah, right. I scorn the company of my own shadow. Why don't you try and hold me down? I will die magnificently in front of you. No one can break my wings. I don't need anything. I just walk by myself. That was Marie-chan's voice. Hey. No way. Senpai, look. All your items are gone. Marie-chan just said, I don't need anything. I just walk by myself. No way. This place is being affected by Marie-chan's denial? Senpai, be careful. This place is definitely strange. I can't put my finger on it, but I've, s I've been having a bad feeling ever since we got here. Alright. Um, wait. Teddy, I thought you were going to... Oh, wait, they took my costumes. They took my costumes. No! Okay, but that's not the only thing that they took. We are now left with the strange sword, which starts like this, and the guys have also the same thing. We also have a white Jew, which... It's plain, it's nothing. So that's the first sign of everything. Also, I have no money. And I also have no items. Good luck trying to get out of the dungeon very easily here. I had them all in, in some of them at Gekko Kid and some of them at Christmas. And I was going to be excited. But nope. No joy for me. Look at that. It's like the remnants of Inaba a little bit. Um... So this dungeon is very unique. You see this gate here? Huh? I don't see any shadows there. Wait, that's not what I meant. There are shadows. I can feel them, but I don't see them. Continue through. Yes. Some of the floors are going to have shadows just like this, where you cannot see them, and each time you break the gate, they're there. So let's just take these guys out. Weak to anything? Alright, well, let's just Magur down the heck out of them and get them out of here. Uh, nope, go down. Go down. Down to down. Yeah, get out of here. I don't like your tongue. You little crazy. Little, It's like a... Actually, you know what? They remind me of the flying mouse from the Pepsi commercial. I think that's what it is. Like, wasn't there like a mouth that like... Oh no, it's the Dairy Queen commercial. The Dairy Queen commercial had a mouth that like licked its lips and closed up. Because it's like... Nice. Alright. So we get 750 experience. That's not a lot compared to the other dungeons. And we get unique items. Firebreaker and Sentu Seed. I get it now. The shadows can attack you, attack when you cut the rope here. Senpai, stay alert. Huh? Hold on. Everyone's spirit is really depleted. Why? Why are you so exhausted? Yep. As you can see there on my right side, everyone has half SP. This is one of the hardest dungeons considerably going through the first time because you are not aware of any of this. You cannot prepare for this dungeon because they take away your items. As soon as you walk out of the dungeon, uh, your items come back, of course, and you can heal with the fox and everything. But it's still a pain in the butt. And not only that, 
you're actually not allowed to leave this dungeon. I have tried off screen. I saved the course. I tried off screen and leave this dungeon, and you cannot absolutely leave the dungeon. It will take you to Juness, and you could train there and uh, finish your quest if you have not. It's the absolute last time that you could probably do so. Uh, I would probably also be careful opening these chests, but I'm going to do it anyways. Lightning Bell. The reason why is sometimes the enemies hide in there as well. These enemies are kind of unique and nice to look at because they're like crazy. No, not... Okay, so Wind will do it to some, but not to all, and then we'll switch to the next guy. Okay. It really does help if you have an SP regenerate on your persona. So Teddy seems to have one, I just noticed. Wait, was it SP or was it something else? Uh, one of the reasons I definitely built Naoto was because of this, but I also like the idea of just having more SP in general because I noticed she is very SP heavy. Yeah, you are. Uh, so I would definitely not grind here if you need more levels. Hey, Senpai, have you noticed? You regained spirit during battle. Maybe you could use that to stay ahead of the battles to come. I wish you could recover a little more, though. Yeah, I know. And I don't remember how many floors this is. So this floor, is, or this uh, dungeon, is ten floors long. There's going to be a mini boss on floor four and floor seven. If my notes are to be believed. Also, I don't know if the Reaper could appear in here if if this is what it is. But you definitely want to def go for chests. And I'm almost done here, it looks like. No enemy? Oh, thank God, because I actually don't want to lose this. Uh, I don't want to lose a lot of SP. Although, the SP here doesn't matter. If you need to grind, as as I said, you should probably go out into the Je Judas world. Going into the enemies here isn't that bad, but honestly, because of the fact that you lose so much SP, it's uh, you should only fight them to grind for items, because they do drop some items. I'm gonna take a, take a spin here, get them all on the ground, and take them out. I'm also going in with a more difficult party, because uh, again, I don't have Naoto. Uh, well actually, maybe I have a more physical party, but then I could add in now Toe for the magic or something. I'll probably play around with that. I'll get this guy. It's a cert. Oh. You could fight while waiting to recover, but it's pretty tiring if all the battles are going to be like this. What can we do? I don't know, man. Okay. So, you get life stones as normal. Sentu seeds are replacing your apples a little bit, but they're a little bit stronger. Uh, sacred branches. If you have a sacred branch, I would make sure you have at least one for the end, so you could jump out and jump back in. Uh, for certain bo for uh the tenth floor, and then you have different other enemies here. Chest key. A firebreaker, which is helpful for it. So some of the da item name changes too. I just wanted to make sure you g I went over that so you guys knew. What the heck? Oh, okay. We're all trained. I'm just trying to blast through the floor. And of course, it's like very difficult. I just saw the Jonas S. Bonner come out. It's over for you. <laughs> ah, that took forever. No, I did it. You did it in one move, technically. The move just turned. Oh, I know, Senpai. Why don't you make sure that you use the items you get from the treasure chest in beating the shadows? Check and see if you have anything that you could use. Oh. Which would require us to look through so it could be a sec. 
So everyone has a party. I forgot to mention, everyone seems to start with a parting stone, but you could get a grief stone. I would at least put one on everyone that you're intending to use. But any, any stones you get, change them out because they're going to recover more. I need to go this way because there's a chest over here. Sacred bridge. Nice, nice, nice. It looks like a Lord of the Rings thing. You are a murderer. By your silent smile, by your composed voice, by your dark eyes, by your bashful fingers, I am slain. I am a corpse. Foolish, wretched, happy. Surely I'll fi- Surely I'll simply brought away. Because you killed me. Huh? I can see shadows here. Where are we? What's with this place? Alright. So... Now we can choose whether or not to fight shadows on this floor. Some of the floors are different on e in each aspect. Is there any items over here? No, oh, there's a shadow over here. That that was rude. Oh look, some tables. They have like some nice uh, stuff over here. Oh, some of something else that could help you out is fusing a persona that has a null physical, which kind of helped me out right there because I had the I had a block go off pretty nice nice all right uh let's put in a one more I guess deal new cards uh, well, I, I tried my luck there. Didn't get it. Alright. Fully restores SP for... Or HP, sorry. For sure, I will have that. Alright. And then go in ahead. An enemy, huh? Are we playing Ring Around the Rosie? Because apparently that's what you had decided to do. Except now I'm like, unable to get away from you. Here, let me go this way. Go away! Stop following me! Dang it. Alright, well that got rid of him, but there's another guy over there. Let me get back to where I was. Okay, I was over here, and then... <laughs> oh, I guess I wasn't that long. I love that they had the Magatama, but it, because it makes me think of Ace Attorney, but obviously it's not what it's meant to represent. It's just like a general spiritual thing that's going on. I got a Fire Jew, which uh, is it what I think it is? Okay, it's a resist fire. So, a faint red cloth that shimmers like a flame. Useless as armor, but resist fire attacks. So. It's no better, it'd probably be better to put it on Chie because she's the one that's weak to fire since it resists fire. So you're pretty much going to be putting on clothing that you can find that are, that is resistant. Not that, if everyone is at the correct levels and you rank them up before this, it should be a lot easier because they have the evade skill or should have the evade skill for their respective things. They also get a drain, or most of them get a drain on their uh, specialty. Like, if Yukiko has a drain on fire because, uh... Sorry. So, most of them have, like, a drain on their, on their normal persona that deals with their, um... What's it called? Element that they use. Which is pretty nice. Rar. Do I really want to use my Zeodyne? I guess I can. Mod is fun. <laughs> he looks like a sass. Like, the way he moves is pretty funny. There's an upper rank skill. I don't remember what skills I put on that one. 
I just used whatever. Having a heal might be not that bad because Yosuke was out of SP. What does Mbata have? I know I put the null physical on there and it regenerates. And it also evades ice. Oh, I guess there wasn't that much I did. I wish I could get rid of that foolish whisper though. I don't wanna use I don't know if I really wanna use that. I guess I am fighting all of my enemies because it's like the easier way to do things. I don't say what level Marie is in my notes, so I think based on how well I'm doing is probably the correct level for your max amount that you should go to if you're doing the low level run. Of course, I could always like see her. Oh, if I level up the persona, wouldn't it give me another skill? No, wait, it doesn't have any more skills to give. Never mind. I misread something, of course. Alright. Just keep going. A lot of it's a lot like what got to Inaba for whatever reason. I gave myself an out, and then I got. Yeah, there we go. Alright, I'm gonna use Baziodine, because I can. Yeah, you can kick ass. Why would I say no? Nice. And then... You can use Garudine and save a little SP. Oh, this will definitely mean you can't use your big skills until we get to the boss, because for sure... The, uh, the skills are a little, like, SP heavy, so you cannot use them very, very, like, oh, I just want to try this kind of thing. Let's see if I can't get one of those. Uh, I kind of want a chest key more, just in case there's chests open. Especially since they took all of my items. I don't know, remember how many chest keys I had. Ooh, a lightning jew. Alright, let's go in on Yosuke, I think. Or I could go on Teddy. Or I could go on you, depending what persona you have, of course. Alright. We step into this area, it kind of reminds... The floating rings kind of remind me of, like... Some mystical fantasy... I was thinking Skyrim. I don't know if they had anything like that in Skyrim, but it looks like it belongs to Skyrim. For mornings when I can't see you, spicy mint tea. For brunch, mar for brunch, a marmalade muffin. A touch of bitter fits my mood. A sigh is stardust. It's like our own Milky Way. I can't catch up to your distant back. Look, twilight creeps upon us. The distance you distance to you is like an eternal night, an eternal pre-dawn. Hey, Senpai? What is all this stuff marie is saying? What does it mean? It may be partially her poems because we, say, we see these pretty often. One of them was referencing the Little Mermaid, which is one of the poems that we have listened to. I see. marie -chan's poems. Maybe it's because of this place, but I feel that these words have some deeper meaning. Some of them do seem to have a deeper meaning. Like, the first poem, when we first walked into this dungeon, definitely referred to how we were going to play the game here. A love stone. Uh, I believe that's better than the... Yeah, it's 16. Alright. Time to swap around. Which wasn't that hard. Okay. Also, I'm pretty sure once we walk out of the dungeon, you can't sell the old stuff. I was a little hungry for that. Oh, hey! Nice. Yeah, it's gonna be hard to level up here. I'm already on the third floor. Oh, never mind. Oh, this dungeon has a lot of things going for it. So it's called Memories of Grief, and a lot of the things that you're getting are feelings in the... Uh, different 
what's it called? Enemy down. There are different feelings, of course, like in the different accessories. Okay. Oh, Judas Bomber is coming in. It's kind of nice that it has all this theming of trying to find what is human kind of thing. I feel like you're almost dead. She just took her. There we go. Alright, let's get some SP because we can. It'll help. Did I get more equipment? Yeah, I got the pain stone. It requires 10 SP on the people. Alright, who wants it? I'll put it on Chie. It was either that or Yukiko, because, like, all the other people. Um, oh, the treasure. Oh, I don't have any more keys. I don't have any more keys. Hey, can you give me a key, sir? Oh, hello. That enemy's weak to win. Well, I was... I was gonna do that anyways. Apparently, it should be easier. Uh, they're almost all dead. Might as well use it up. I'm willing to fight it out on the... on nothing else. A tedious... Oh, oh that's... A, that was a cute pun. Also, I got no key. Because I didn't do the thing for it. Womp womp. Alright, come on now. Let's see if we can't... Nope, you got attention. Dang it. Alright, what is your weakness? Wow, it's puny. Anything... Helps, I guess. They want you to use your magic up for sure, even though it seems like a bad idea. But I'm like, you might as well use it since there's no SP regen on these guys. There's, like, you get some during the battle. It helps negate some of the bad. But it, it doesn't negate all of the bad because, of course, I need two keys. What a schmuck. Oh, there's an extra. What's over here? Does it require a key? Can I get a key from you? That was easy. <laughs> that was easy. Oh, well, it's not really easy, but if you think it's easy, you go right ahead and think that. Uh, a th fourth key. I need a fourth key. Sir, please give me a key. I was talking, and I guess Siri mistook something I, uh, said. <laughs> I don't know if that got picked up on the mic, but if it did, oh boy, I would love to include it. Because that was funny. <laughs> Alright, uh... SP simple. Oh no, there was a key! Oh no! Oh no, what did I do? Oh, wait, there's another enemy. Can I redeem myself? I didn't need to take the stairs, I could have just used the Y and leveled up, but. Can I please have a key? I would love to have a key. Alright. There's no key, but I could get a four more. Change Arcana. Change Arcana to a key. That's not a key. Alright, well, I guess I'm going upstairs then. Might as well, since I can't open any of these chests. Alright. Hey. How long are you going to wear the... How long are you gonna wear that ugly mask? You know you ain't got the guts for this task. 
Cover yourself with paint. You're acting like you ain't. Afraid of what you're gonna got in store for your fate. You think you got me? Well, that's too bad, because I ain't stupid enough to get had. So drop the pathetic act. I want to dance, and that's a fact. I am a clown. A pathetic clown dancing forever. Ever. Senpai, Marie Chan created this place, right? Look over there. That's Juda That's the Judas side, isn't it? I see stuff. I see other stuff from the shopping district here and there. What does all this mean? She remembers us, but she ha feels like she has like the. Maybe she has like the destroyed perception of being able to. Um. Well, feel like she can do anything with us. Hang on, I feel something. It looks like you could be attacked by shadows when you cut the ropes here, too. Are you ready, senpai? Should we continue through? Uh, yeah, we could continue through. This isn't the boss, of course, but something here. This guy is new. This uh, red-legged guy. Those aren't his legs, but it... <laughs> They act like his legs. If he wanted to kick us, you know? Here, kill that thing. And then, what is your... You're weak to win, but you missed. We missed. This guy has a high evasion rate or something. It dodges ice and evades win. So it's better to use ice on it, in a way. Uh, I'm just going to use lightning on it to see if I can get a hit in, of course. Sorry, I got distracted. Maragadine. That hurt. Uh, well, at least it hurt a little bit. Uh, Garadine, you. Come on, man. Go down. I was looking at something on my screen because I wanted to double check since I believe this is the fourth floor. It doesn't label them, but... Oh my gosh, you stupid piece of poop. Go down! There we go. Alright, sweet bonus. Get a chest key, finally. Uh, I'm gonna get a skill up, but I guess a level up. It wouldn't hurt, right? Nothing could be changed. Okay, that's what I thought. Uh, let's see. There are so many ways to go. Definitely so many ways to go. I'm just gonna wander until I can, I guess. <laughs> she wanted us to wander, I'll let you want think where I let you think where I'm wandering to. I'll have this chest though. A shadow jump up. Are you kidding me? Okay, please don't kill me. I have these. This is not fun. Anything? Oh, oh, we just yes, do that, do that, do that. Yo, yo, this is it. You did me. Yeah. We can smash this. Smash these things. They poisoned us. I don't like that they poisoned us at all. Oh, but they're s tough as nails. Alright. I could have healed there, actually, because Teddy's taking a lot of damage because of the poison. Yikes. Kablooey! Man, these guys are annoying. Ah, oh, I missed. They're do they take the same amount of damage, and now everyone else has 
Ouch. Missed on most of us. Yeah, I could tell. Alright, let's see what we could do. I'm gonna have Teddy see if we could heal us with what little magic he has. Alright, Teddy is no longer poisoned, but everyone else is still poisoned, so I'm going to use Amarita to stop the poisoning. Alright, and then... We need to keep attacking now. There we go. Okay. Uh, man, my greed has no bounds, I suppose. Revival beads. Oh, that'll be perfect because I will need those. Okay, Lightning Jew, that's also going on Teddy. Alright, we still need some more if we could get so please I know there was probably a lot on that last floor because of course that's where all the chests were oh okay so this one connects but it's probably a fight this way is probably a fight too hold up let's see if we can't okay these so these connect and lead back to the beginning so it's either go left or right in the, in the central business so let's go this way all right and Let's do forward so we can get the chest key. This. Uh, change of persona. And I'll grab both of the personas, I suppose. I probably need to fuse, don't I? Yep, I do. Okay. Um. Here's the thing. Since we are not going to do much more story, I don't think there's going to be much more story. So I'm going to replaced by low level personas of course with higher level personas so that I can make a better persona how many times can I say the word persona oh um that doesn't look like it leads anywhere but I guess I could do it ah oh, you son of a gun I knew it you gotta fight your way to the good stuff and my reward for that is Suffering Stone. That probably connects. Okay. Oop. So there's a hallway. You can see it kind of looks like a hallway. I love how the dungeon connects on each other like that. You can like figure out if you need to open another... Thing or not. Clearly it doesn't look like it's an easy path to this guy over here. Nope. Of course not. Alright, what kind of items do we have? I have some breakers piling up, which is a good thing to see. We also have a bunch of uh, sacred branches in case we need to leave, but of course... Ah, that sucks. <laughs> that just happens. Oh, if I go back... Okay, I'm gonna go back and see if that chest is a... Gold or not. Oh, it looks like it parts ways. It, does, uh, it makes you go around? Really? I want an SP. And I got no... No key, no nothing. You don't get a key. Alright, somewhere at the end of this is probably the boss. Like, if I could feel it's close. That's an enemy for our chest. Oh, hello. We got a new enemy over here. It looks like a knight's hand. <laughs> Look at that knight's hand just standing around. 
Alright. And then Bufa dying just to get rid of these guys. Alright. Get out of here. Oh, no, no for me, because of course I didn't get that guy's weakness. Oh, you son of a- oh, hey! Oh, hey! Please! Thank you! Something, a sorrow stone. I will take it. Ah, oh, dang it! I connected. I mean, it might be helpful if I'm trying to get that chest down there. Oh! Uh-oh. Hey guys, I think I just found the boss, or the mini boss. I wasn't sure when he was gonna come up. I was just wandering around. Okay. This guy is the Gorgeous King, right? Yep, okay, Gorgeous King. So we want to beat this guy quick. Beat him to a pulp. Uh, he is physically weak, so we should just hit him as best as we can. He is going to be like those other giants that poison us. He also summons enemies, so he's really annoying that way. He's just going to... Alright, maybe I should have used the Garudine and then see if we went for an all-out. Oh, well, it's alright. But, uh... He summons helpers, and if he does spirit drain enough, then you're, uh... Going to suffer to a Megidolon. So... You want to take this guy out as quickly as you can. I'm gonna have to end this video soon, so after this boss battle, I'm going to find the stairs, go up him, and save. That's my plan. Alright. Make sure he... Aw, uh, he also could dodge physicals, so... That's what makes him difficult. You think, oh, beat him to a pulp? That's easy. Might not be a ZZZ take. Okay, let's do beat the king first. And then use a Bagaradine. That hurts the tree. And then we get another one more. And what's your weakness? You're weak to ice. Okay, well, I'm gonna wail out the king some more because I can. Any damage is good damage. And then just Bagoofa died. And then go wild on the king. Get rid of his helpers. He doesn't need any helpers. He just needs to deal with me. I said deal with me. Yeah, get him, Kanji. Yep, do it again. Anytime you can get him down to do this, it helps. Because you do, like, a lot of damage to him. Yep. Oh, walk a jam. Ah, oh, you filled me with silence. How dare you? Oh, maybe I should have... Hold on. I forgot to attack the king. What am I doing? I love his robe, by the way. He has, like, a black robe over there. Nice. You know, if I'm silenced, it actually probably doesn't matter whether or not- Oops. It probably doesn't matter whether or not the king gets, like, messed up. Or if you can't use his persona, because, like, the king can still get messed up with the physical attack. Alright, and then just attack the king. Do this in style. Alright, seven. What more of them? More of them indeed. Ooh, yikes. Okay, uh. Uh, God. This could be Harry. Hold on. Attack the king first. Go, Yosuke Senpai! Magaradine. Go, Yosuke, Yosuke, Yosuke is no longer poisoned. Thank goodness. What is your weakness, Mr. Hand? Lightning? Okay, well, I know I do have a lightning, but I'm saving the items, of course. 
uh, Ember Brita, just so everyone is better. And Kanji, oh, you know what? That's fine. I can bazaar Mazio died. Oh my gosh! Don't miss like that. <laughs> Thank God. Hit that king. If this king were on a deck of cards, what, uh, what, uh, what do you think he, like, what is his suit? That's what I'm trying to ask. Is he a heart? Is he a spade? Is he a... What is he? Alright, this will work better if I do this. Take him down like this. There we go. Everything's down to the ground. Just wail on him. Alright. Uh, attack this guy. It's my turn. I'll send you to hell. Oh, nice. Those criticals are nice, Kaji. Alright. That wasn't too bad. And yeah, we got Vigor Song. Vigor Song is going to go over. Relaxing wave. SP recovery effect at the end of battle has become stronger. And that is Risei's last skill. Nice. Please don't, like, encourage another battle. Aw, oh, of course. I'm just worried, you know? I don't have to. You're probably saying, oh, I don't have to fight the enemies. But I do need the items, which is why I'm doing that. I guess I'll take the half XP. I mean, I had to. I had no choice. Alright, right, and then... Will it... Nope. But I can't get it. Alright, let us go up. Because we can. The hated, cold things, living a lie, people wearing a mask of deceit, that is me, and that is you, the liked, warm things, living a straightforward life, kind people who engulf everything, that is you. Senpai, are you alright? It looks like we still have a ways to go. Don't let your guard down. Yeah, we do. Unfortunately, I'm going to save this for the next episode. Thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you guys then.